USC Upstate is in the Atlantic Sun Championship here at UNF Arena as the Spartans take on the Ospreys of North Florida. Upstate has already beaten UNF two times previously this season and goes for their first ever Atlantic Sun Championship tonight. Congratulate North Florida. Uh, they, uh, they they deserve to win. I think they outplayed us, not by a lot, but enough. And um, you know, we, we certainly wish them well heading forward. I think our team showed a tremendous amount of character, uh, fortitude, toughness, togetherness, all those types of things. So I'm real proud of them for that. Obviously, we're disappointed we lost, but we're proud of these young men, particularly these three seniors. It's not only our team's dream, but I would say that you know, this is the dream to go to this tournament since you're a little boy, you know, playing, watching it. Yeah, it hurts. Um, you know, in our program, we, we stay pretty much the whole summer at school. You know, we don't, a lot of us don't go home, and if we do, it's not for extended periods of time. We put a lot into it. Um, and, you know, we had a lot of people doubting us this year, our team, and, you know, us three, took it upon ourselves to, you know, make it ours. And, you know, we won 23 games, and we took another step in our program by making it to the A-Sun Championship. And we're very disappointed. Um, but, you know, it was, a great, it was a great game. We're just – we just wish – you know, wish we had a couple more of those shots back, a couple more possessions back, but that's how it goes sometimes. We've been on the doorstep. I mean, you know, we maybe not in the final game, but, I mean, we – Two years ago, we lost an overtime game to Florida Gulf Coast, a, or maybe it's three years now. A uh, one possession, last possession game, and then they go to Sweet 16. Last year, we, you know, Mercer, we lose to them in overtime. We, lose, we beat them by 19. They lose, we lose to them at their place in double overtime in the semifinals, and then they go in and beat Duke. So, you know, the, the fine line that exists in our conference, when I first went into coaching, if I, we ever won a second place trophy, you know, I, I threw it in the trash can. I didn't think it mean any much. I don't want, and so that's kind of how we think, and that's how I want them thinking. Um, not that we didn't acknowledge 
we had a good year. Not that we didn't acknowledge that we won 10 or 11 off the road games. Not that, you know, we, we held 16 opponents under 60 points. We did, you know, we did these different things, one on the road in good leagues and that kind of stuff. But uh, we're, our focus and our goal is to, to get to the next step. We're proud of what we achieved. We're proud of what we did, and particularly proud of, uh, you know, the very first meeting we had in August, we talked, we're not going to listen to the fact that we lost four seniors, four really good players, and this and that and the other. We're going to compete for a championship again, and that's, I think, Ty's words. These three guys took it upon themselves to model and pretty much demand that kind of thinking out of our team. And I think uh, that has much to do with our success in anything.